Hey, hey, so this is the video I promised you. Um, first in our garden is our little trees. They're kind of sad because <laughs> they don't have any leaves yet. Um, look, right here. I don't know if you can see them just starting little green leaves. Um, this tree, these three right there are exactly the same. I don't even know what they are. Um, they actually just landed in our yard. We didn't actually plant them, but we like where they are because when they grow high, it will cover the neighbor's balcony. Um, here you see that the wall right here. That's the wall that used to be start here and go all the way down um, the yard here. And it used to be like, I don't know, about five feet tall. We took it down and we just dry stacked the back part of the wall um, there with the nicest stones. I think it took like 40 trips to the dump to get rid of the huge, huge wall that was here. And then we just separated the nice stones. This tree actually has leaves now. Got them like in the last two days. And this is a, what kind of a tree it is? Blue, um, blueberry, I think. I think that's what that is. Um, we didn't plant this either. He landed in our yard too, but we like them, so. Yeah, we kept them. And then dude painted this wall, um, redid the gutters because those gutters, that's actually our neighbor's balcony and their water, when it rains, runs off and just comes into our yard. So he redid the gutter to go out to the, the side. And then we bought this guy, look at this pot. It's freaking amazing. That is an Italian um, olive tree. So we bought that like two weeks ago and the, the plant and the pot and decided to put them at the edge of the yard. This is hibiscus. Normally he's got little red flowers. There's one going to come up right there. And he's doing really well. He's good this summer. Whoops. Almost fell there. Um, and this is lavender. This is... I can't remember what this is. Maybe this one's the hibiscus. I can't remember lavender all along this we're gonna take out it was these beautiful pink flowers last year we have another one over here more lavender doing well hasn't bloomed yet there's another one of these they had little pink flowers um we're gonna take those out and plant something new but it's been so cold here it's like minus two at night that um we just decided we're gonna wait on those so this is our cherry tree i don't know if you can see but it's like got so many blossoms on it. It's tons this year. And then all these right here, this granite, we're going to make here, all here, 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 a big, um, like, I don't know, just base because I'm going to put a fire pit there um, so we can roast s'mores and stuff. And then this is our sidewalk that we're going to redo. We got those pots last year. We're going to redo this. This is from like, I don't know, the 1970s. Dude already started to take up some of it. But we're going to um, re-tile it with some tile. I think we're going to do that the next week or so when I'm on vacation, if the weather's good, and get that retiled to look nice. Um, yeah. And then... Oh, and last year, dude redid our archway. This is a really old archway from when we bought the house. I don't, I don't know when it was put up, but the house has been here since 1776. So I have no idea when it was put up, but he re-tuck pointed um, this wall and retiled the top of it. And then we got these pots with these little cool, I don't know, um, I guess they're porcelain, I'm not sure. Little flowers here, and then at the end right there too. And then these plants here, they normally, we set them up here, but it's gonna be very windy starting tonight, so we put them down. Um, and then on this other side right here, I forgot to show you, that's a 
bougainvillea, but he hasn't come out yet. And like our, like our vine is, our little vine from here is starting to now creep up the wall. It'll be all green pretty soon. And then we've got our huge pine tree. I like him because he's green all year round. And then here we have a weeping Judas. And uh, see the blossoms are just, I don't know, just coming out a little bit. It'll be in full force. I'll do another video for you on this one when they get it, but he's really big. He was super tiny when we first moved here. It was like just this little teeny tiny stick, like probably that size right there when we first got him. When we first moved here, like... 11 years ago. Now it's huge. He's gorgeous in the in the summertime. And then last year we planted these along the house. Um, they have purple flowers, but I don't know what they are. And there's another one, same thing, planted in the house. And then this is night night blooming jasmine. We painted. Uh, we planted that one last year too doing pretty well and then over here all these plants some of these are going to be planted this year but we haven't yet just because it's been so doggone cold so all of these are just now getting looking pretty good this has these huge huge purple flowers that come up when it blooms huge and then these are Provencal um, olive trees so we put two of them here. They're supposed to grow really tall so we can block the neighbors on the other side. And then all of these plants, we're getting ready to end up planting them soon. Um, as soon as it gets, as soon as it gets warm. So there we go. Yeah. Mm, looking better, better than what it was before. So I'll send you another video as soon as all the leaves and come out on the trees, they'll look better.